My whole uh, goal over the summer was to get to know guys. I didn't want to walk into training camp and say, hi, I'm, I'm Steve. Uh, so that was the point of, of summer. You know, I had two goals. One was to build the staff, and the other was to get to know the players. We've got good guys. We've got high character guys who, who want to win, and they've been nothing but professional uh, with me, and they can't wait to get started, and, and I know I feel the same way. We want to move the ball. Uh, we want to cut back on our turnovers. I think we averaged 17 a game last year. Uh, we want to get the ball moving from side to side. There's a lot of different ways to do that, but the whole idea in this game is to make the defense have to react and adjust and make multiple rotations, and if you can do that efficiently, then they have a better chance of breaking down and you get a good shot. One of the best rules of thumb in basketball is you know, if you're not open, pass it. It sounds pretty simple, but you know, players want to make plays, and, and you have to ingrain in them that if you move it on to the next guy and he has a better opportunity, then we're, we're going to get better shots as a group, and that will make everyone's job easier. Andrew's one of the best passing centers in the, in the league. He's one of the best I've ever seen. And so for us to get him the ball on the elbows um, as a dribble handoff guy, backdoor pass guy uh, that will be emphasized I want to get him the ball in the block too uh, he can score down on the post and uh, I will definitely ask him um, to, to be aggressive down on the block I, I, I believe in throwing the ball in the post uh, I know the game has um, changed over the last six eight years there are not a lot of post players and a lot of teams are just spreading the floor and you, you get your penetration through the dribble uh, I believe you got to throw it throw it into the post and play out of there, especially if you have a good passing big, and we have several. So uh, Andrew will be uh, featured in, in a lot of ways. I thought it was a great experience for both of them. I, I haven't spoken with Clay. I did speak with Steph. He said he loved the experience. Um, and I know from watching Clay uh, and talking to some of the coaches who were over there um, that it was a really good experience for him too. I thought he took a, a big step confidence-wise, um, you know, to play on the national team and to be one of the best players and most consistent players and to have all the coaches, you know, lauding you for your effort defensively, I mean, that, that's got to make him feel pretty good. What, what